Read code number 1443. Minimum time to collect all effort in a tree. Uh, this is a medium question. Let's get into it. Uh, given an undirected tree consists of n bodies, numbers from 0 to n minus 1, which has some efforts in their bodies, you spend one second to work over one edge to the tree. Return the minimum time in a second. You have a span in order to collect all apples in the tree starting at vertex 0 and coming back to this vertex. The edges of the undirected tree are given in a tree edges, where edges i equal uh, from i to i means that it exists on edge connecting this vertex from n2. <laughs> I'm not sure why this one is undirect because this one is the direct tree, right? Okay, additionally, there is a boolean array has apple, where has apple i is true, means that vertex i has an apple, otherwise it does not have any apple. Let's check with example one. In this case, uh, first, first two, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So 2, 4, 5. 2, 4, 5 has effort. So time is 1 second, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So return 8. Example 2, in this time, uh, uh, 2 node has effort. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So return 6. And then saw this that there are no apples, so time is zero. How will you divide this? Do you have any idea? Okay. Mm. Uh, today I gonna show you one idea to it make it simple to implementation. So my idea is I will check. <coughs> I'm gonna check uh, descendant of uh, descendant of the node has apple or not. In this case, if this has apple, it's descendant. This one has apple, and that time this one also true. And then in this case, this one is true. And then, but when you collect this one, it takes zero time. So I will deduct. Did not count this one. And then. Every node, I will when I the, the, I will uh, count the node has its apple or its descendants has apple. So in this case, one, two, three, four, four multiply two. So this one is what what I we looking for. Did it make sense? The reason is uh, every node. When you traverse the every node, it takes the two seconds because going there, back to original position, going there, back to original position, going there, back to the original position, going there, back to the original position. So when you count one, this one means one, two, three, four is the same as a uh, number of node and then one edge we needed to use twice, so that is region. Why we put two? Did you make sense? Oh, uh, does this make sense? Uh, from today, I will use does this make sense because one of my friend uh, uh, tell me uh, it make sense is not correct. So from today, I will use it. Does this make sense? Okay, okay, let's implement the code. So first, maybe when you that traverse this one, I will use the DFS. Uh -huh. And then I will receive node. And then I will implement it later because I need some data structure to use it. So next is the, we provided the edge. So this time, and then when you the traverse DFS, we needed to information about the node and then is children. So I will make uh, the information with it from the, the edge. In this case, I think that we needed to what is name is good. Uh, name is children. 
because we get this one from the node so key is node and then uh, value is children so children is I will use array in array and then length is same as Linky same as n because it provide n vertical zero to n minus one. So I will do, it. and then I will get the information and the node and its children from the edge. So for node and node and child in edges, and then children node at the end child and then you can use it and then one more is we need to time variable study is zero okay i think it's enough so first non occur we needed to use time and children and then first we needed to uh -huh. traverse okay and then for child in children of node and then okay uh -huh. we need the descendants descendant has apple means we will return the dfs child so child has the, this apple, we also have this apple, so has apple is the has. If uh, node itself has apple, or descendant has apple, that means the regards, if my descendant has apple, I also have apple, to count the uh, number of nodes, so has f initialize with has apples not so if this one is true or if this one is first but this one is true has apples true now if has apple and and then we we did not count the zero right because their distance is zero so uh, node not zero I will increase time to 1 to yes 2 because we visited visit and go back it takes 2 seconds all right and then I will return has apple then to return here right so this is children to return has apple okay good now run DFS start with 0 node and then return time Let's check the code. Okay, looks good. Wow! <laughs> Amazing! Great! Okay, in this time, let's check with the complexity. Time complexity, uh, we traverse the every each node, so time complexity is linear. And then when you make the children, it also take linear space. So. Uh, linear time with linear space. Thank you.